congratulations to the history majors in the class of 2020. You've worked hard to get here, and we are so very sorry that your final semester, one meant to be filled with such joy, pride, and reflection, was cut short. We recognize and celebrate your accomplishments, even if it cannot be in person right now. We also realize that some of you are not in the mood to celebrate. And we know that everyone is zoomed out at this point and that all we have to offer is yet another video. At least you get to see your instructors in their new natural habitat on Planet Zoom. During your years as a history major, you've studied subjects ranging from zombies to Elizabethan monarchs. You've researched the history of immigrants and presidents You've debated the meanings of the Mongol Empire and the legacies of the Roman Republic. You've spent countless hours in the basement of Francis Scott Key Hall, lurching from its humid seminar rooms to its freezing lecture hall. You mastered the art of footnotes in your 208 and crafted memorable final essays in your 408 capstone course. You are ready to take on the world. Collectively, we want to acknowledge your success. The transition to an online environment proved challenging for everyone, and your resilience has been truly admirable. Finishing your degree under such circumstances is no small achievement. You all should be very proud. We also want to underline the significance of history as you embark on a new chapter of your life. In an age of fake news and alternative facts, the skills you developed as history majors to think critically and engage with primary sources and modern scholarship alike will serve you well. Not only in the workplace, but in life in general and as informed citizens in particular. You have become avid readers and lifelong learners, eager to cultivate your intellectual curiosity. And you will continue to cultivate the values of the humanities to imagine the world of tomorrow and create a more fair society. We'll have a great need for a young generation of historians such as yourself who have learned the traditions of our profession. We hope the skills you have learned here will strengthen our communities as we move from catastrophe to recovery. Finally, uh, we want to acknowledge the uncertainty that many of you feel at this juncture as you are about to go out in the world. Some of you have jobs, graduate school plans, or service projects in place. Congratulations. Others of you may still be searching. It's okay to not know what to do next. To not have a career lined up. To be living at home for a while. To debate whether to go to graduate school. To try a job in a new field. To take some time off to recover. Or to question all of the plans you've made until recently. Please know that we are here to support you and that we are available if you want to chat. We are really eager to stay in touch with you all. We are so proud of our graduating seniors and just as proud of our terrific alumni. Congratulations, Congratulations Yeah. All right.
Ready? Yeah, ready. Sorry. I was muted. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> For the making of. Great start. We'll try that again. And I thought Elsa was supposed to read the first paragraph as well. Uh, do you want Claire to go? I think actually Patrick's next. We're about to start a business, guys. Are you going to count us down? <laughs> I think my internet's frozen. We're almost there, people.